<laughs> this is a dramatic reading of Jenny's About Me. A path of self-discovery, a world of change. I'm in rapid movement now, and nothing can stop me. Suddenly, it's not all about what I am, it's who I was. Jenny of the past is spilling away and replaced by a new kind of beauty. I tend to observe the world from afar. I find myself never getting too close. I watch people having their movements, and somehow it just makes me happy to see someone else smile. I am the shadows that the sun forgets to reflect. I can be distant, or I can be extremely close to you. My head is always spinning. I have been told I'm wise, but really, I'm just an old soul. I have the common sense people forget to look at. A lot of the time, I feel like I have it all figured out. Until I hit a dead end and I'm lost again. I'm the girl that the dance, the dance that will dance, the dance of the sidewalk on the sidewalk to the music playing from stores, then slow down and fall into thoughts most cannot even imagine. I'm fascinated with figuring out everything around me, at least so it is clear in my eyes, people watching just studying society, figuring out why people behave the way they do, psychology mixed with other things, realizing the higher meaning, spirituality, and philosophy are all fascinations of mine, along with the paranormal. I'm a new ager, and I find it a little annoying that no one knows what it is. I believe in auras, spirits, chakras. Astral planes, astral projection, clairvoyant, and whatnot. Please, please look it up. I'm spontaneous. If my friend and I are driving back home from down the street, sometimes I'll say, you know what, let's just go somewhere, see what it takes us. You know what, let's just go somewhere, see where it takes us. I am also an artist, a writer a peacemaker, and an all-around outsider. I have my own way of looking at everything, and my own theories. I create, therefore I am. I love to see something taken from my mind and set before me with my own hands. I love to write songs and sing them out loud. Knowing my mind's perceptions can, in fact, become reality. I often get very confused about people and generally anything. And along with that, I tend to become extremely paranoid. Those are the flaws I have to work through the most currently. I love to help people. One of the most important. Words. One of the most beautiful things in the world is seeing a crying face smile again or a scream quiet down softly. I sometimes fear, I mean, I sometimes fear I'm losing my ability in my own rapid motion, but I try my best. I like to help people grow to see what they can be. There is nothing, nothing too far away. There is no one too broken. Juvenile crap and an unnecessary drama. It's definitely something I try to avoid. I like open minds and people that stand out from the crowd. Someone that didn't become who 
They are from anyone else. They. Oh, I'm getting bored just reading this. <laughs> Can I even finish this? Where am I? Finish the story. I. I like open minds and people that stand out from the crowd. Someone that didn't become who they are from anyone else. They just are. They are crazy. They are free. They are different. And they are evolved being that is going to change the world. I love the flaws in people. Imperfections of beauty. I saw, and I say, I love humans, but I really hate, I just hate humanity. I just, I just, I, I don't feel a connection. 